me, Jess Marie. Welcome, welcome back to one of my videos. Welcome to a week in my life. Orange Theory Fitness Coach and first time mom. My baby is almost five months old, which is absolutely crazy. But today is Monday, August 12th. We are starting the week by going on a little walk at the park. I wanna try to do this more often. I've really been slacking on my fitness game and walks, mainly because it's so hot outside, but trying to get back on it. The baby is really tired, so I'm kind of hoping he goes to sleep during this walk and I'll just walk until he wakes up. Usually his naps are about 30 minutes, so that's a nice long walk. Pretty hot out, but it's nice and cloudy, so not too bad. If you're not ready, be sure to subscribe down below and gonna enjoy this little walk, listen to a podcast. And he's out, little sleepy boy. Almost two o'clock, just got home, made a little yogurt parfait. I walked almost four miles, 3.65. Very hot outside, I was very sweaty. So I'm gonna eat this yogurt and then do the normal cleaning things that I do on a Monday, just clean off our kitchen table, probably vacuum, maybe start some laundry, and then I have some breast milk to bag. So just a little something to get our week started off right. First, I'm gonna start off by bagging some breast milk. I just collect it in a mason jar from pumping or collecting my letdown from Haka. So I'm gonna get five ounces. Normally I do four ounce bags, but we've been playing around with giving him five ounces. So pour five ounces in here and then pour them in these bags. I love these bags. This is my second time buying them. Just the ounce, the date, and then stick them in the freezer. Okay, just got two bags from that mason jar and about three ounces left over, so I'm just gonna leave this in the fridge for now until I get a little bit more. My stash in the freezer finally fell on us this weekend, so I definitely have to reorganize it, but for now, just gonna leave those right there. Baby's taking a nap, so I'm gonna vacuum. Knock on wood, this never wakes him up, so. Tuesday, it's 10.30, the baby is taking a nap right now. So I was watching Love Island, which I should probably turn this off. Now I decided to do a little workout. I coached two classes tonight at 4.30 and 5.45. The 4.30 class is the Tread 50 Strength 50 class, and 5.45 is the regular Orange 60. So I was just going through the template for the Strength class, and then I still have to go through the other one. But I think I want to do the Strength template today. I've been trying to set my workout split up to match Orange Series Strength classes. Even though I've been loving upper body workouts, I know I need to do lower body too. So I'm going to do today's template. It looks very good. Got a little yoga mat here and some 10 pound dumbbells. I really want to get some heavier weights, maybe like 15s or 20s because these are honestly a little heavy but when i do lower body i know i need to use some heavier weights so i think i'm going to play around with listening to a playlist that i think i want to use tonight that way once i get to work it's nice and easy i just i can just go ahead and put it on Such a good workout and perfect timing because the baby's now waking up. <laughs> good morning. Good morning, boy. Good little baby. Oh. Good morning. Good morning, cutie. While the baby's playing, I'm going to put together all of these pump and bottle parts. Definitely should have checked the weather. It is currently raining, but I got this umbrella here. That way we can still spend some time outside without getting wet. Not sure if you can see, but the rain is coming down.
it started pouring and thundering a little bit so we took this party inside and this past weekend we actually put together a little jumper for the baby and i've just been having him play in it for a little bit and he loves it it makes me a little nervous because i keep saying that babies really shouldn't be in a jumper because it's not good for their hips and i also keep saying it's okay as long as they're not in it all the time and i definitely don't plan on putting him in it all the time so just playing in it for a little bit here and i have this from his little play mat that i just put under because i felt like he couldn't really touch the ground and now he can so it's now 4:10. just got to the studio about to set up for my classes i'm gonna go ahead and turn on all the rowers even though we don't need them until 5:45. but that way i don't have to do it in between these classes because first class strength 50 chart 50 second class regular orange 60. i'm also gonna get my demo station ready and just kind of practice what i'm gonna say and then i'll just go out into the lobby and chat with the desk staff and wait till members get here <laughs> hopefully rock these classes i also need to go over the orange 60 template a little more i did a little bit today but not as confident on it as the strength D since I got to take strength D kind of at home. And of course, getting the mic on, just put batteries in the battery pack, turned it on, now clipping this to my pants and then headset will go around my neck and then this is not my mic puff that is somebody else's so i have this little green thing that i keep my mic puffs in and also some earplugs my mic puff on then i'll always give it a little check check that's odd but i'm just gonna turn up the music and I'm ready to coach just finished coaching classes and they went so good i also had a little bit of caffeine before classes so i was just wired but now i am resetting the room for tomorrow and we need incline benches so i'm about to raise all these benches and just show y'all setting up equipment for tomorrow i should have to turn off all the rowers and wipe everything down vacuum and then be good to go it is now wednesday i've had a very productive start to the day if i do say so myself it is now 1 30 we're heading to the grocery store but this morning i got up did a little workout again while the baby took a nap i did today's strength of the template which was total body and it was so good, I loved it so much. And then I started some laundry, started the dishwasher, bagged some more breast milk, and cleaned the pump and bottle parts that I used yesterday, so now I just have to put them together today and fold the laundry and empty the dishwasher. But it's a very nice start the day. Now we'll run to the grocery store, I don't know if I said that, just to get stuff for dinner. And then I'm gonna come back home, drop everything off from the grocery store, and then I think we're gonna go to the park for another little walk. But yeah, feeling really good today. I didn't vlog anything this morning just because I didn't really think I was gonna have that productive of a morning, but yeah, I'm pretty sure I do that in every single video so didn't miss much now 219 just got to the park and we're parking at a different area today so parking closer to the playground and stuff but i like this park because there's these little camera boxes so i don't feel as nervous to come here especially by myself hey at the park come and get this baby let me get this baby I got this creamer at the store yesterday that I know is gonna taste good in iced coffee. Not sure about hot coffee, but we're about to try it out. It's pretty good. Obviously the creamer I usually use every day is very, very sweet, and this isn't as sweet because there's no sugar in it, but that's the point. It's like a healthy, healthier creamer, I guess. Like, but there's hardly any ingredients. It's now Friday. I vlogged a tiny bit yesterday, but then I honestly just completely forgot because yesterday was a crazy day of going back and forth to the studio. I sat at the kitchen table yesterday morning and kind of gave a rundown of the day, and the day didn't really go how I thought it was going to. Basically, I had to go to the studio for a template rollout meeting at one, but the templates never got released. 
released. So went up there, found out the templates didn't get released. And so the meeting took 15 minutes going over the calendar for September instead. So after that, instead of driving, 30 minutes up there for a 15 minute meeting. I stayed up there with the baby and did a little upper body workout. I just did the strength 50 template for yesterday. And then after that, drove home, got ready. My husband left work early because yesterday night, I ended up coaching the 4.30 class. And at 5.45, instead of having a class, we had a member social that was a little game night. And that was so much fun. So my husband brought the baby and stayed for game night. And we played Pictionary and this other game that was super fun. Yeah, that was yesterday. So it was just kind of a bunch of running around. But I did get a couple clips from game night that I just posted on my story. Now today I'm getting ready because me and the baby are gonna go meet my sister at the mall and I don't really plan on buying anything but I know it's just gonna be fun just to walk around so I'm really excited. And then tonight my husband and I are gonna go to Texas Roadhouse and that is my favorite restaurant and we're gonna take the baby and that'll be our first time taking the baby to a restaurant just the two of us with him. Last weekend we took the baby to eat at a restaurant with my husband's grandparents and he actually did so good. He's only been into three restaurants two when we were at the beach in oak island that i vlogged and then this past weekend when we went with his grandparents now that he's a little older it's not as hard as i thought it was going to be just because if we turn him around so he can look at things he is just looking all around and he's very entertained so i'm really excited to take him to texas roadhouse this will be my first time going to texas roadhouse since having a baby the last time i went i was pregnant so yeah my sister just texted me that she's leaving her house so i'm gonna finish up doing some mascara and then clear eyebrow gel and then we will go to the mall